Sister Givings is here with us this week. I'll be working on week two's entry in the faith-based May monthly subscription box titled Joy. And I'm using scriptures from this modern English creative journaling Bible, The Promises of God. And I'm using items from Michelle's faith-based sticker shop, Vin Von Alley. Use my PR code Vicky20 to save on your purchases. And this is week one. So take out your devotional book, Bible, war binder, journal, planner, and join me in week two's entry. This week's scriptures and focus scriptures, we will learn how can we cultivate joy, John 16, 24, where is joy found, Philippians 4, 4, joy in the Holy Ghost, Romans 14, 17. The scripture and focus scripture reads, John 16, 24, titled, Sorrow Will Turn Into Joy. Until now you have asked nothing in my name. Ask and you will receive, that your joy may be full. Philippians 4.4, 4, title Exhortations. Rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I will say, rejoice. Romans 14.17, title Do not make your brother stumble. For the kingdom of God does not mean eating and drinking, but righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Spirit. The devotional reads, My invisible partner, Holy Spirit, reminds me of God's word, especially when trials and circumstances tries to steal my peace and joy. I'm so grateful for the comfort and counsel of the Holy Spirit. And this is a true representation of what the kingdom is, righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. Romans 4:17. For this month of May, we challenge you to evaluate at the end of each day whether any moments of excitement you felt were true joy or happiness. If they were moments of true joy, how did you share this with others? Be sure to journal all of this. If we're to measure our joy by not having that house we want, not having enough money, not having that perfect job or position or mate, then we don't have an understanding of what is truly the joy of the Lord. This joy provides us with not only confidence, but with the solid hope that whatever is going on in our lives, God is in control and he will make everything beautiful in his own time. Ecclesiastes 3.11. Blessings. And here's my week two's entry on joy. Give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and turn on your notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a video. Thank you for spending your time with me. Until next time, I hope today your heart desires. Latest.